Our lesson for today is about select measuring instruments. An understanding of measurement is essential for all parts of manufacturing and production technology. There should have a uniformity of measurements so that people will have common application and understanding in the production and use of manufactured objects. Measuring tools are vital in producing quality output. It is essential also in examining finished product or semi-finished product. Here are some measuring tools. You can pause this video for you to identify all of them. If you cannot identify all of them, we will discuss it further. Compass This tool is used for scribing or drawing arcs, circles, parts of many symbols, and radii. Divider This is like the compass construction. As the name implies, divider is used for dividing distances into several equal parts by the trial and error method. Protractor It is used for laying out angles and measuring and setting of angles other than those obtainable with the triangles. Ruler is the most popular type of measuring tool. It is usually 6 to 12 inches in length. It is needed for measuring sizes and distances. It is also used to measure things that are small. Most roller shows customary units of measurement like inches and metric units of measurement such as millimeter and centimeter. are the 45 degree and 30 degree by 60 degree. The illustration shows the proper use of drawing lines and measuring angle using T-square and triangle. Triangular scale. It is used in general drawing. Its main purpose is to reproduce the dimension in full size or to reduce or enlarge them on a drawing. Scale help a drafter Keep the proportion accurate. T-square is used as a guide in drawing horizontal lines and in measuring up to 48 inches straight line. Yardstick or meter stick. It measures one yard or meter and shows only metric units of measurement of feet, inches, centimeters, and millimeters. It used to measure objects that are larger than a piece of paper. You have now identified measuring tools and select them appropriately to measure according to job requirements. Let us now discuss geometric shapes. Geometric shapes can be defined as figure or are closed by a boundary which is created by combining the specific number of curves, points, and lines. Class, are you familiar with geometric shapes? If you are not familiar, we will discuss it further.
formed by four straight lines. Each sides measure the same length, but unlike the rectangle, any of all angles measure 90 degrees. Circle. 